2019 is a year with a series of victories. Yeah. Lift your hand and thank God. Thank you. For 2018. For 2018. That all darkness is yes. staying behind in 2018 yes. in your life. Holy and that you are moving hey. into a higher type of light hey. in 2019. Lift your hand and begin Mama to thank God shake it. Holy for victory. Holy and thank God for leaving behind 2018. Every disappointment. Every shame. Every gap. Every mistake. Is left behind. As we leave behind 2018, Father, we thank you. We thank you. We thank you. Everyone lifting your hands. Thank you for your blessing. Thank you for your blessings. We are grateful. We are grateful for what you have done Jesus. so far. Yes. We thank you as we've entered the new year. Hallelujah. With victory. With victory. Victory is our portion. Victory is our portion. A series of victories. Yes. Many victories. Yes. From victory to victory. Hey. From victory to victory, hey. a series of victories hey. await us in 2019. Hey. 
We lift our hand and we say, Only you can do this. Only you can do this. Only you can do this. Only you. Our eyes are on you. Our eyes are on you. And we thank you. And we thank you. For this great blessing. Yes. Of introducing us hey. into 2019. Hey. In Jesus' name. Jesus. And everybody. Name. The snake that followed you throughout prophesy, prophesy. 2018. <laughs> I said the snake that followed you. Prophesy. The snake with different <laughs> colors <laughs> that followed you to <laughs> 2018. <laughs> couldn't cross with you to 2019. Yeah. In the name of Jesus. Yes. You are going to be stronger in spirit than ever before. And was filled with wisdom. All right? You are going to be filled with God's wisdom. Amen. And number four, the grace of God was upon him. So the grace of God is going to be on your life in this new 2019 year. Now, your life is changing and these four things are happening. You are going to grow. All right? So, when you are grown up, what you couldn't carry before, you are able to carry. What you couldn't bear, you are able to bear. So, in 2019, you are growing up to be stronger and more capable in every area of your life. Next, this year, it's not about decreasing. It's about increasing. It's about growing. So if you live outside, you don't have anywhere to stay, you are going to grow into your new accommodation. Amen. So expect to grow in every aspect of your life you are going to grow and wax strong in spirit and I don't so you are mean that so from this year you are going to be stronger in spirit can i have an amen from those outside no inside no when i have to specify before you those outside say amen Beautiful. Those outside on this side say amen. Okay. Now, what's upon him? So, grace is going to be upon you. Things you don't deserve. Grace means undeserved favor. So, this year, many things you don't deserve, God will do for you. You don't deserve a beloved. Because you've broken seven hearts already. God will do it for you. Even though you don't deserve it. You don't deserve a child. Because you have thrown away so many children already. God will give you what you don't deserve. You don't deserve a job. Because you are too proud to work humbly. By the grace of God will give you the job you don't deserve. You don't deserve for somebody to give you help. Because when it was your time to help, you didn't help. But the Bible says the grace of God was upon him. So in 2019, may you experience things you don't deserve. In Jesus' mighty name. Hallelujah. Amen. So in 2019, expect a series of victories. Expect what you don't deserve. In Jesus' name. Lift your hand and say, I receive what I don't deserve. I receive what I don't deserve. The grace of God. I receive it. In Jesus' name. Amen. 
So receive the light of God to lighten your life. You will be guided throughout 2019 by the light of God. God's light and direction and wisdom will be your guiding light throughout 2019. Yes. Your decision as, as to who to marry will be guided by the light of God. He said it's for the rise and the fall of many, but you will not fall. I said you will never fall. I can't see your hand and I can't hear your amen. Let me hear your loudest amen. Let me hear your loudest amen. You are crossing the whole of 2019. 12 months with ease. Yes. The three dogs that have followed you, they are all bound. In Jesus' name. I want everybody to stand and thank God for these four things. As we come to the conclusion of our prayer time tonight. Thank God thank for you, growth. Yes. For strength, for strength in the spirit, in the spirit, for wisdom, yes, and the grace of God, and the grace of God on your life. Thank you. These four things, thank you, will be plenty in 2020 oh. January. Shikam you are crossing into 2020 with, with grace, with grace, with strength, with strength, with growth, with growth, with wisdom. Hey. Thank you, Lord. Father, thank you for making a way where there seems to be no way. Yes, Lord. Thank you for making us stronger. Always, Lord. In 2020. In 2020. Thank you. We are crossing 2019 yes. with ease. Yes. We have entered 2020 prophetically. Hey. Stronger. Stronger, wiser, wiser, better, better in every way. Yes, people will testify. Thank you for all the children here who have lifted up their hands. Hey, Lord, thank you for calling everyone, oh. blessing everyone, touching everyone. Oh. In the mighty name of Jesus, I thank you for all the children that are here today. Oh, yes. Their lives are better. Their lives are going to be better in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. And everyone shouted, Amen. Amen. Lift your right hand like this. Jesus, thank you for the impartation of your power to everyone. In Jesus' name, Amen. Your blessing for 2019. Let your feet walk in new places yeah. that you haven't been before. Yeah. Let your feet walk in pleasant places yeah. in 2019 yeah. where you haven't been before. Yeah. May you go there this year. Yeah. In the name of Jesus. May you enter countries and nations that you haven't gone to before. May you walk in hotels you haven't imagined before. May you walk in the corridors of power that you haven't walked in before. May you have visitors in your life. Type of visitor you've never had before. A good visitor who brings good things. May you experience him in your life in 2019. May somebody come to your house and his coming change your life for the better for the good for the improvement may you be visited with many gifts this year in 2019 
I see baskets being carried to your house and carried into your life in the name of Jesus. May your money be more than it has ever been before. Before 2019 and from 2019 onwards, may your money know an increase into the realm of surplus in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, let your face shine upon your children. Let them, even when they are cut down, spring up again. Even when they go through a dark hole, let them come out shining better and brighter than ever before. Let them not lack anything. I change their pocket size from small size to medium size to large size to extra large size to Ebola size in the name of Jesus. Your pockets are blessed pockets. Your secret places are blessed secret places. They are filled with the treasures of darkness. And the wealth of the wicked is placed squarely in your hand. In the mighty name of Jesus. Now, let the strength of Jesus, the greatness of Jesus, who never tried to be great, but is so great that today we all mention his name. We pray to him and through him. May that greatness, that mysterious greatness be imparted to you. As you also embrace Jesus in your heart. May the mysterious greatness of Jesus, the mystical greatness that makes him so awesome, so great, so majestic, so worshipped, so honored across the whole world over 2,000 years may that mystical mysterious greatness be imparted to you in Jesus name your life is taking a turn around plagues plagues that have plagued you plagues that have plagued you since your youth and in the year 2018 are completely vanquished and neutralized in the name of Jesus. May his face that is shining on you make everywhere around you bright. Brighter and brighter. Brighter and brighter. Brighter and brighter. I said brighter and brighter. Let your seat be full of light. Let your chair of authority be greater and be filled with light in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. May the Lord be a fortress around you. Receive divine protection. Divine escapes in 2019. Divine exemptions from disasters from tragedies, from bad news, from red and black cloth, from funerals, from burials, receive divine exemptions and divine escapes throughout the year 2019. You shall escape many times by the hand of the Lord. May the angel of the Lord encamp around your house, encamp around your tent, and camp around your dwelling place. Ah, only with your eyes will you see the reward of the wicked, but you will not taste of it. The Lord is my refuge. In him will I trust. May the Lord be your refuge in 2019. 
and grant you divine exemptions and divine escapes throughout the year 2019. You will see 2020 with your bright eyes and you will give glory to God for what he has done. And now your ministry. May your ministry go brighter and brighter. May you serve God day and night. May you serve him with prayers, with fastings, and with whatever he has chosen for you to serve him with. May you serve him and bless him and honor him. And as you serve God and you honor God, may God's honor be on you. May people honor you, respect you, and value you in 2019. May your value increase in 2019. May your worth increase in 2019. May the number of people that value you and honor you increase in 2019. And because you have set your love on him, may he deliver you. May he keep you. May he save you. May he rescue you. May he exempt you. In the name of Jesus Christ. I see the feathers of the Lord. The feathers of Jehovah. All over you. Under his feathers. You are going to dwell. You are dwelling under his covering. The Lord's feathers. Are your roof. They are your ceiling. They are over you. You are in his hand. And he will keep you in his hand. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. May you excel in your ministry. May you multiply in your ministry. May you increase in your ministry. May you be fruitful in God. In the name of Jesus Christ. And as your value increases. May you have the opportunity to travel to the ends of the world for the sake of Jesus Christ. I bless you with the greatest blessing, the honor of being God's servant. May the grace of God that made some of us servants of God for the prime of our lives be upon you. That the prime of your life will be used as serving God and in serving God forever. In the name of he who laid in the grave by his own will and rose up triumphantly who gave himself voluntarily and without question in his name I bless you. I bless you and I command the blessings to be upon you. Let the flowers of your life come forth now. Let the beauty of your life come out now. Any delayed beautification, delayed glorifying of your life, I accelerate it now. And I declare that the niceness of your life comes forth in 2019. In the name of Jesus, the Son of God, sent by God the Father I bless you and I say may may Jehovah look upon you tenderly with forgiveness with mercies with graciousness may he overlook your mistakes and may he say play on play on my servant I have seen but I have not seen may God wink at all your evils and your mistakes Throughout the year 2019. And may he grant you to bear much fruit. In the name of Jesus Christ. Now lift your two hands. And thank God. That according to these words. So shall your life be. Father we thank you. By a prophet. Israel was brought out of Egypt. And by a prophet. He was preserved. 
may you be preserved throughout your escaping time throughout your living time in 2019 even if you cry it will be for a short time the Lord will wipe your tears away and give you something better Father we give you thanks and we give you praise for all that you have done in Jesus name and everyone said amen, amen. God bless you God bless you God bless you 2019 is a year with a series of victories amen, amen. I said, it's not a year of victory, it's a year of a series of victories. Kalaba shakaba yandaraba.